A mysterious ancient village suddenly appears deep in a dark cave. On the cliff, the gurgling water slides down from the green moss. Form a beautiful water curtain. What kind of secret place is in the cave at the bottom of the pit? Deep in the mountains of Tailai Township in western Guizhou. A bottomless pit that goes steeply downward. Dense vegetation. Chopping cliffs on all sides. However, there is a mysterious ancient village hidden at the bottom of the pit. Who would live in seclusion at the bottom of a 100 meter deep pit? How did he get down? Liu Yong's family, a wealthy family, is not considered a landlord. On the contrary, he is very rich. We learned this from the mouths of local elders who collected medicinal herbs. Kengdi Guzai is a local with the surname Liu, a shelter built by members of the Communist Party of China to avoid bandits. In an era of underdeveloped technology, they followed the vines on the rock wall and entered the bottom of the sinkhole. When each of us dreams, the era of being a rich man, I can't imagine what the rich people had in those days. When the poor are struggling for three meals a day, when you are worried, it's hard to imagine that the rich are also frightened. The bottom of the sinkhole, which has not been visited for nearly a century. What kind of scene is it again? When we come to the pit, the old vines no longer exist. You can only use professional SRT single rope technology. God descends a hundred meters. One herb found here. What herb is this? Does anyone know? Called Big Gold. Men's Kidney Power Station. Man ate him. It's good for him and it's good for you. The woman ate him. It's good for him and it's good for you. You can clearly see the cave entrance from this position. Here it is. After changing the sixth anchor point, we immediately reach the bottom of the pit. There is still mist coming out of that hole. It must be a sinkhole, under a crack in the mountain. This should be a water channel. When it rains in summer, water comes down from above. I've reached the bottom of the pit safely. Stand at the bottom of the pit and look at the topography of the pit entrance. Cool is this when Wangu in Wulong. The plants here are so dense, basically up to the top of my head. Hey, comrades, wait for me. Where do you bite? Look, I can't even see inside this plant. It's so scary in here. Where is this place? Well, I can't find my way there. Because the pit mouth is relatively large. Plenty of sunshine and rain. The bottom of the pit that was not destroyed. The original ecological environment is beyond our imagination. Such a primitive pit bottom. There must be unpredictable dangers. In a flat and open place he. Wait for all team members to reach the bottom of the pit. Go straight to the east exit. The unknown area ahead. What else is waiting for us? Now we have reached the entrance of the cave. There is mist inside this cave entrance. Look at the water here. It flows all year round. There are no cattle or sheep coming to graze. I saw a monk coming to wash my hair. Oh yo. This water. Long flowing water. Brother Pal live broadcast. Let me sing a few lines for you. There's that black moss growing on his rock wall. Don't know what it is. There's a crab. Climbed so high. Isn't this crab in the creek? How could he climb up the rock wall? Can crabs also use SRT rope technology? There is a two meter high cliff at the entrance of the cave. There is a deep pool below. But did you see it above the cave entrance? There seems to be a city wall there. There are also traces of artificial masonry on a small hole. Maybe it was the place where Liu Yuanwei hid the bandits. Let's look at it from another position now. The stone wall in the cave entrance. See more clearly. A native groove was found in a small tunnel above. Opposite him. This place is also a groove. 
He might have had a staircase here before, all the way to the cave entrance. Now Xiao Bei is using the form of nail climbing outdoors. Enter the hole and return the wiring. We made a big U from below to the entrance of the cave. After you come in, there is a small passage. There is a deep shaft in front of this. It's such a heavy fog and it's so dark. I'll give you a big stone. Lose a hundred heads, throw it away. I lost it. Well, it's full of water down there. But do you see it here? There are also artificial stone walls. We have to dig nails from here and climb over. Wow, there must be a lot of space up there. We made a crosscut through that small hole. Now it's my teammate Xiao Bei. Immediately enter the big cave on this side of the sky. Come this way. There is a big cave. Look at that rock wall. As soon as the light shines on it. Shiny. This circle is surrounded by artificial walls. This hole is built up. But this hole is very deep, you see. Take a look at this stone. Wow. Throw a big one over. See hey. Below is a very deep shaft. It's a pool. We don't need to go. Here is a bowl. Found a bowl bottom here. This is a clay bowl. After coming here. This hole is quite wet. I don't know about the former Mr. Liu. Do you have rheumatism? A big cave. Hey, there's a small skylight up there. This shaft is like a belly button. Hey, over here. I'm the same one here. Upward shaft. My side is a passage leading to the second floor. This location is also a pile of artificial walls. Get out of here. It's the cave on the second floor. Come this way. It seems like you can see everything at a glance. This is the charm of the cliff cave. This is a water hole. It should be the place where we used to get water. Oh, take a look to the end. Comrades. Most of the cliff caves are not very deep. Explore so many cliff caves. It's rare to see a deep tunnel. Look, this is a blind hole. This is also a place to get water. A nest dug by people. This is a blind person. Generally speaking, it's a hole. The area of this cave is quite large. I can see the entrance of the cave from here, right? This hole. There is a small crack up here. Wow, there seems to be a layer of tunnels up there. Let's go take a look at the cave outside first. Come back and explore this crack. Because of that crack, there may not be a way. You see, this is a road built by man. Lots and lots of noodles here. It's drier up here. It's obvious from this. There's a small road over here. Where in life do we not meet each other? Really just go to this small road, right here. Have you seen any coal here? There is coal. Are here. This is a place where coal is stored. There are two pitfalls here. Where is the stove? Underground. Wow. A hole has collapsed here. You can see it. This side is entirely a platform built artificially. It's probably a place for people to rest. This is also a platform for one person to accumulate. I'll go up and see what you're doing on the other side. The opposite side is an outpost, right? Fortifications. If anyone comes, throw stones from here. It doesn't look too high from here. Huang San, come on. Look below. Huang San crosses the big U again. There is also a small platform here. There is also a stove here. This is a little interesting. What's this? It feels like tiles. It's really a tile. A stove core made of tiles. A furnace core. Oh, this is. This is the most complete antique stove we have ever seen. It's been at least decades now. Look at the ventilation here. Everyone, don't think that you enter this kind of village just to hunt for treasures. What kind of treasure do you think there is? This tile. Did you see it? 
This is the Sichuan and Yunnan Guizhou area. The tiles on this house. There are so many bats here too. It's so disgusting here. View from inside this waterhole. It's all about that. Road paved with burnt cinders. It seems Liu Yuanwei lived here for a long time. There's a rough bowl here. Or is it glazed with a layer of glaze? There are patterns. Come back from this cave entrance and see this daunting. Just that big. We have now finished visiting this cave. In fact, it, it's about 100 square meters. Let's go inside the crack we just looked at. See if there are any other caves. Well, this is the place behind me. Climb up from under here. There seems to be a big cavity up here. Look how high this place is. Wow, the rock wall is sparkling with gold. It's actually just a layer of water beads. A light shines. It's reflective. Do you see there's a big cavity up there? I can't go up here. Wow, this is so spectacular. I can't get through here. Can't I go up? I can't get up here. You can go up here. Look here there is a small calcified fossil. I'm going to start from here. Climb up and see this stalactite. Climb up and see this stalactite. He's actually not slippery at all. Very easy to climb. Did you see? As long as you hold it steady, you'll be fine. Anyone who climbs with bare hands has a chance. Moving loosened the stone. It's so beautiful up there. Calcification pool, come up quickly. This is amazing. Look, there is a small calcification pool inside the calcification pool. Like lotus. Just a shaft. You can't go up from here. Drill another nail. Rika eats cowpeas and hangs his brother. <laughs> wow, it's so spectacular here. We come from that cliff. After climbing up here, it will be on top. A nice shaft. Wow, so beautiful. This shaft here is about 30 meters high. But it's weird. Why are there fresh leaves down here? That means this. There must be a passage up there. Otherwise, where did this leaf come in? Look, there are some red dates on his side. This stone is so smooth. There must be a lot of water rushing down in the summer. Otherwise, this rock wall, it won't be so smooth, will not be blocked. It's so weird that it won't be dissolved by this water. This miraculous work of nature. You really can't think of it. These stones were dissolved by water and looked like knife edges. This is very sharp. If you don't pay attention, you'll get injured and get a cut. So you must pay attention to safety when exploring in the wild. Look at this stone. Wow, so beautiful. Dissolved like this by water. Beautiful, I decided to carry it out. Hello everyone, I am Brother Pal. Tonight is the first episode of my wilderness survival. I'm going to camp under a sinkhole. Wrong, wrong. I said the wrong line. Now I'm under the sinkhole. Wait until all my teammates have leveled up. I started removing this line. After you finish taking off the rope, our caving today has come to a successful conclusion. This video was shot here. Thank you everyone for watching.